Hey guys, so I don't have a live video for you today. Today I'm going to upgrade the software on my cuboid 150 watts. It has already been upgraded to software 3.14, but the Joytech gave a firmware version 5.14 and it's out since September 12th. So basically what I'm going to do is go to joyatech.com uh, go to software download and uh, download this version for windows it doesn't it doesn't really have any readme so what we're going to do now is connect my cuboid to my computer So it has found that version that I'm using is 3.13 and I'm just going to click on update. It will disconnect from my cuboid and I will select this cuboid version 5.14 binary. And well, that's about it. So immediately you will see that there is version 5.14 and there is something different here on the screen of cuboid oh, the screen has been updated so it has this roundy thing inside but I'm going to I'm going to uh, switch it to temperature control mode and for that I need to unplug it and set up my <coughs> trusty Samsung batteries. Here it is real quick. I'm going to put on some, my trusty Samsung batteries and I'm going to enter the menu. So I don't know if you can actually see this, but there are some roundy things that are like, oh no, 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 no. Those are not roundy things, <laughs> those are not smiley faces. There are some actual numbers going on there. So I'm going to place my build on it. It's a pre-built Twisted Tiger Velocity and just wait for a couple of seconds. The smoke on this Velocity is fantastic and I'm only, only burning my Twisted Tigers at, at 60 watts. I'm going to play around with this menu style for a bit and I will redo the video and give you my opinion. 